as I'm against the uni fees and the cuts in funding. Um, I know I'm at, at a uni where they're high to medium risk category um, and then quite a lot of stuff are getting the sack and the pensions are being affected. They were on strike a few days ago and I was on the picket lines and thought I'd share my support and then I'm here to show the government I'm not I'm not having it basically. <laughs> I'm here for similar reasons to Lucy. Um, I'm against the rise of tuition fees, I'm against tuition fees altogether because they exclude people from uh, lower class and working class backgrounds who should otherwise be at university. I'm also against the fact that, you know, even after I graduate, the likelihood of me getting a job is very slim because of all the putbacks in the public and private sector as a second result. I also think that ideas like the big society and things like that are just means of uh, abolishing the public services and just putting them in the hands of anyone basically and that's why we look into things like the Jaro, we create the Jaro marches which are going ahead um, because we think that you know all these years later all the struggles of our ancestors you know the, no further you know no further more secure in, in gaining employment and think that we need a large-scale demonstration to demonstrate against the government what they what, against the government what they're trying to do but one day won't be enough we need sustained action which requires anti-cost groups to be formed and to join an organised resistance so that's why I'm marching on the 26th okay I'm marching um, today to show the government that there is opposition to the cuts that are being made and to raise you know it's called the march for the alternative and we think that there is an alternative to these cuts that the bankers could uh, give back the money that they owe the country they're getting millions of pounds in um, bonuses the money that's lost in tax evasion and avoidance should be collected in by the government straight away um, there is enough money that exists in the society to pay for the cuts and um, to pay for public services and avoid making any cuts and so we're going to show that there's mass opposition to this and so raise that after this demo it's good that the TUC has called it but there needs to be coordinated strike action between the unions to really put pressure on the government and say that we're not going to accept um, these cuts.
right. Don't be a talking head, I'm filming it. Well, it's why are you here today? Well, me and my young lad here, Tim, are here today to fight against the cuts on the half of our PCS. Tim wants to go to university, he wants a future. He doesn't want cuts to stop him from doing that. So he's also here to see a bit of London. We're hoping to get some shopping done later too, but I don't think we'll have the time. Let me see you.